So we've talked about how important joint mobility is. Now we're gonna go ahead and look at our own necks and examine what kind of flexibility and joint mobility do we have throughout our neck. Again, remember, that is 16 different joints that we're gonna be assessing. So five different motions I want you to look at. First is side bending motion, where you bring your ear towards your shoulder. And again, you wanna be looking straight ahead, so it's almost like a windshield wiper motion. Check right and left. Then you're gonna turn and look over your shoulder in both directions, left and right. And again with this one, what I notice with a lot of people is they cheat. If they don't have good range of motion, what they'll do is they'll tilt their head backwards to gain some extra motion. So you wanna make sure that your chin is turning this way, keeping it level with your shoulder. And then finally, you're gonna tuck your chin down towards your chest, and you should notice that your chin is able to touch your chest or thereabouts. Those are the five different motions we're gonna check. If you want, you can go ahead and tilt your head back as well, just assessing with all these motions whether there's any discomfort or limited motion. Next, we're gonna check and see what kind of upper cervical motion we have. 